So, oh, it's just gone really bright and now you probably can't see me. Oh, that's so tragic. <laughs> Let's start that again. Good morning, happy Monday. It's moving vlog three. So, bits and more to kind of happened since I last spoke to you. I had a sofa delivered, the sofa is being taken back because it doesn't look right, it doesn't, like it's too big. So, um, what else have I done? Put my bed up and just little bits and bobs that I didn't film because I just feel like, you know, seeing me put up furniture isn't the most exciting thing in the world. So, today we have a ton of things to do. It's actually fashion week and um, I'm supposed to be in London, but I mean, I've moved house so I can't get to any of my things for me to be in London. So I'm unpacking as much as I can today so I can pack and go to London for the rest of the week. But, uh, the main task today is to unpack my makeup, which, oh, it's going to be a task and a half. Uh, but we're just going to get on with it and see how it goes. It should be fine. We've just been and done a food shop and got some bits and bobs and I have a chocolate croissant, which I'm really excited to eat. And there's a new Starbucks near us, which we just visited. Wasn't it pretty good experience? It's insane. It's so good. It's just the same as the other one, but they have contactless, so <laughs> it's really easy to pay and waste all your money on coffee. But yeah, our Monday is being, you know, it started really well, really positively. So yeah, I'm just, I'm very excited for the week ahead. And I, um, just to clear things up, because I know a lot of you are asking, am I still using my vlog channel, kind of what's going down? I will still be vlogging on my vlog channel. I'm just doing my movie vlogs on my main channel because I know so many of you wanted to see what was going down. Uh, so I, I, should, I should vlog some of fashion week. That would be fun, wouldn't it? Like the behind the scenes and what's going on. If you um, get the school camera back, yeah. Yeah. Can't yeah. take that one. Someone's just texted me and Libby's looking at me as if I'm going to be really disappointed with the text. She's like laughing. <laughs> <laughs> Is it going to annoy me? No, no, it's good. Okay. Well, oh, that's fine. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm hoping to get my G7X back. Um, we should probably ring... can't carry that one. No. Actually. We should probably ring Canon and see what's going down. If not, I'm going to have to get another one. Because it's just getting a bit silly now. Um, <laughs> so, Libby, so who's going to be like that? Right, I'm going to go with my chocolate croissant and then we're going to start on the makeup. Okay, let's go. <laughs> so this is what we're working with. This is my makeup that needs unpacking. Um, yeah, there's quite a lot. Like, just a little, not a ton. Oh, yeah, there is. So it all needs to go in these drawers and I've got these Alex drawers as well. But we're going to start with these ones first because I'm actually going to arrange it all by brand as opposed to kind of product type. Just because I feel like that's way easier for me. So... <laughs> lot and a lot of drawers so yeah we're kind of just gonna have to make it work You're actually just playing with the makeup. Yeah. Oh, I, I had see. Had green lips and blue lips. <laughs> <laughs> so this is what we're working with. Um, it's you know we're getting better, but there's just still boxes full. But I mean, we've started to. It oh, good. it's empty. It looks like I've not done anything. So we've got drawers. Like we're getting there. Do you want to show some of the drawers over here? These are kind of the interesting Let's drawers. See. Oh, yeah, that's NYX, Tarte, Tarte, the Balm, Too Faced, Benefit, Benefit, oh. 
Yeah. They're all very much. Actually, sh show them. Naked. YSL. Oh, Naked. <laughs> um, decay. Yeah. Um, YSL and Giorgio Armani draw. The only looks great one. Gorgeous. That's what everything's gonna look like eventually, but as you can tell, I am doing everything by brand this time. This is how it's being organised. Um, so, yeah, it's just looking a bit different to how it looked previously, but I think it's gonna work better for me. So that's what we're going with. Um, but yeah, I just have three of the flat Alex units kind of stacked up on top of each other. And then I have two Alex 9 drawers. So in here is going um, like brands that I kind of don't use as much or don't have as much product from. So like uh, MUA, Max Factor, brands like that. And then just here, I'm getting IKEA PAX units all the way up to the ceiling of drawers to put skincare, all things like that in. Uh, so yeah, all of this and all of that is makeup. <laughs> so we're getting there. We're, we're not doing bad. Hi. So <laughs> it's lunchtime and we've made salmon and veg. It's not going to focus because this this level doesn't like to focus on things unless I tap it. But Chris, look at that. There's a lot and there's a lot of mash, but you know. Sometimes you just have to listen to what your body wants, and my body wanted mashed potato. Um, sure. Yeah, what's new? So we are eating salmon, purple carrots, orange carrots, and white carrots. Oh. Purple. Oh! They're actually purple. Purple carrots! Madness! So let's eat our lunch. The unpacking is continued. We have moved on to perfumes just to kind of change it up a little bit. I mean, I think the makeup progress is going really well, isn't it, Liv? We've like yeah. not honestly got that much left to do, but I've just unpacked all my perfumes. So I actually keep all the boxes, which I know sounds extremely excessive, but I, I seem to have moved quite frequently over the last few years. So it just seemed to make sense to keep them all. But I have just come to the conclusion that I have an unnecessary amount of perfumes, but I, I just wear them all on different occasions, so I can't get rid of them. I'm gonna zoom you in and show you the perfumes that I do have. We'll have a little talk through them real quick. So, everything's a bit kind of messy. I've literally just took them out of their boxes and I've not put them anywhere. So I'm gonna put my Juicy Couture up the front because I wear this all the time. Uh, I have some new ones I haven't checked yet, uh, haven't tried yet. This one's from Galan, this one is Sky by Giorgio Armani, and just a few, so I have two Juicy Couture's because I wear them all the time, so I'm going to pop them at the back because um, obviously I don't need two. This is a new one from Giorgio Armani, as is this. One is kind of the female and one is the male, but obviously you can wear either. Literally, I prefer the male. Yeah, I prefer the male one too. So this is Chanel number no. 5. I actually bought this by mistake. I wanted the Chanel number no. 5, like the fresh one. I don't actually know what it's called, but it yeah, it was the wrong one. So this is going to go towards the back so I don't wear it too often. Uh, Giorgio Armani C is like my go-to for like evening out, so I'm gonna have these quite near the front because these make me feel amazing when I wear them. I also love this one by Replica, this is Lazy Sunday Morning. They made me one of these, um, inspired by one of my pictures, which I think is absolutely incredible and so kind of them. Uh, so I need to go and pick that up from my management. But yeah, this one's got half my name on it. Quite a few of them are like personalised, which I think is absolutely fab. Have quite a few Victor and Rolf ones. They have some incredible scents. So I'm going to put C right here. I've got my... Oh, hello. Dropping everything. I've got my Misty Or and then my Misty Or Absolutely Bloom. Please ignore my chip nails. It's very embarrassing. My Gilly Hicks La Perouse. Love this. This is fab. Now these are actually filters for the replica perfumes. And what they do is kind of change the like kind of tone of it. So you can like glow, make it more glow or like make it glow more even or like blur it. Um, love Gilly Hicks. This is going near the front. These are quite similar to be fair. Like they're both quite fresh perfumes. And I'd wear them both kind of on similar occasions. Uh, and then my newer one's kind of near the front, so I use them more. And then, of course, we have to have a little space for all the rubbish that I accumulate just on the edge of my perfume cabinet, so. That looks quite lovely, doesn't it? What's that one? This one's Sky by Giorgio Armani. I've never actually tried this. Uh, let's spray. Testing. Ooh! Do you know what? Whoever did, like, design the packaging, it smells smell exactly like you'd expect in the packaging. Like, yeah. by looking at that, does the perfume not smell exactly like you'd expect in a package that looks like this? Yeah, I can imagine I'm having that. Mmm. It's really, it's really nice, but not the kind of thing... To be fair, I'd probably wear that on a day-to-day. -day. It's not too florally, but, 
like I'm more so for evening times Giorgio Armani C is like my everything I need some more like kind of oody perfumes um my one I wear every single day without fail is Juicy Couture the original one this is amazing since you were 16 yeah since I was like 16 I've had so many bottles this is the new one and this is like think Cher from Clueless this is Cher in a perfume. Um, this is Viva La Juicy Glacé. And I went to the, a dinner for it the other week to kind of learn all about the perfume and it is just incredible, it smells amazing. And the only reason it's going at the back is because it's near my other Juicy Couture one and it has to be near each other. So yeah, that's pretty much my perfume collection. I mean, I'm pretty impressed with it. I don't know about you, but I think it looks really pretty, but it's gonna be a pain to dust around them. But you know, you, do, you just do some things just cause you know, they look nice. So that's where we're at. Update! Who's so, just driving by? Pardon? Who's just driving by? Who? Andy B! Andy B! Andy B. Um, we're done for the day, pretty much. Um, we just have some bits and bobs, like the rest of the stuff basically we didn't have drawers for yet. But, like I said, perfume's done. In here we've got more kind of drugstore makeup that we don't have much of. I say we, because it's a team effort, everything's shared in this house. We then have my higher end makeup, which I don't have as much of. So like Marc Jacobs, I love their products. I've got, you know, a full drawer full of this size, but not enough to fit in like the larger drawers. So they have their own special drawer here. Um, Marc Jacobs have beautiful palettes, by the way. There's a few in here that I'm just like so in love with. Hey everyone. So we are finished, we're about to head off to the gym. We've done as much as we can today, but I'm gonna be back later to like move my desk in and stuff, so I will show you. But we have to take a quick break to go to the gym. I've got my gym gear on, and <laughs> we're going to the gym. Let's go. So pleasing all the horrific lighting, I picked the shoddiest bulb ever, but this is how we're looking. Got my desk in. Uh, I'm just gonna keep the same desk that I had previously just because it's, you know, works out better, kind of value for money to keep that. I've got my drawers, I've got my other drawers, and then the rest of the stuff to put away down here. Uh, in fact, you're coming with me. Um, yeah, not bad really, not bad. So I just wanted to end this vlog off by saying there is more coming soon. My baby is back. Oh, I've been trying so hard to film on like other cameras to vlog with but I just wanted to like say a massive thank you to Canon for fixing my camera again. Uh, she had a smash screen. I say she because my camera is my baby. Like it sounds so silly but I did not realise how hard it was to manage without this little thing. So yeah we are back to vlogging. We are back to on point content but good quality. So yes. Uh, Thank you so much for watching this vlog. I really do hope you enjoyed it. Please do leave me a comment down below if you did enjoy it and we can have a little chat. And I'm about to go and film another moving vlog right now. So I will see you then.